I'm back with another video. Back, 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 back. And today I am here with a hair collaboration with Kriya Hair. And y'all, do y'all see how long this hair is? Like, what? And flowy and everything. And I put oil on it. And it's still not weighted down. Like, this hair is beautiful. If you like to see how I achieve this look, then give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. And let's get right into the video. All right, y'all. So I already got my wig cap on because we about to just jump right into the video. We got us a wig. Okay. And another wig cap. But I already got a wig cap. So I just be collecting wig caps, honestly. Okay, so we have their name is not on the box. Like <laughs> their name is not on the box. I'll figure it out by the end of this video whose hair this is. Because their name is not on the box. But whatever. I got me a closure wig. Yes. Oh, this is like a. This is giving five by five. Like this is big. This is real big. So y'all, honestly, I'm gonna have to go bleach it because I be having to bleach my wigs. Like I like it to be bleached. So I'm about to go bleach this real quick, and then. I'm going to come back. Never mind, I'm not going to bleach it. So, I'm going to show y'all how to do a wig without bleach. um, And still make it look natural. Because people be like, you got to bleach your wig in order for it to look natural. But I'm like, no, you don't. So, I'm going to show you guys how to do this without bleaching the knots. Um, So, I already got my wig cap on. That's good. I'm not going to be gluing this wig down. I'm going to be, got to be spraying it down. That's not glue. It's a holding spray. So, literally, I could put water on it and it'll come right off. With glue, you gotta you gotta use alcohol, you gotta use oil, like stuff like that. But it got to be sprayed, you don't use none of that. So what you need for this install, you're gonna need some concealer, and we're just gonna go in order. So I'm gonna take my light shade that kind of matches my skin tone, that matches my skin tone, and then I'm gonna tint the lace. Alright guys, so I got the lace tinted how I like it. And now what we're going to do is I'm going to put a little powder on my hairline right here. And y'all going to see why. It just helps melt through. So I'm going to just put some face powder, literally my facial powder, on my hairline. Literally to like camouflage the black a little bit. And you guys are going to see why I did this. And it's going to look so fire. Y'all about to see this. Alright. So y'all already know that the wigs come with the um the bands in the back, the combs and all that good jazz. So you better just go ahead and get right into it. Make sure that you fit it on and that it's fitting good. Like you want to make sure it's fitting good. Y'all see that? See, I told y'all. Bleach for what? You need to bleach it. You don't need to bleach it. All right, so y'all, with the combs, make sure that you're combing it back and that it feels comfortable by your ear because you don't want it to feel uncomfortable by your ear. You want it to be comfortable and not, like, too tight. So you can scoot your wig cap back just a little bit. Okay. And what you do to one side, y'all already know. Yeah, I don't know. Black just hit different. Like, black hair just hits different. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but it hits so different. Like, I don't know. And this hair came straight, as you guys can see. So, I'm going to leave it straight. I'm not going to um, curl it up. Normally, sometimes when I have straight hair, I'll curl it. But, I don't know if you want to curl it today. So, we're just going to bone straighten. We're going to bone straighten it. And, um wear it like that all right y'all so i'm about to go ahead and perfect the part and the lace so maybe i should scoop this over a little bit all 
All right, y'all. So I'm about to go ahead and spray this. And, or I might do... Nah. I'm going to just go ahead and spray it. So we're going to push this back. Like that. I'm gonna use my got to be spray. And I'm gonna spray it across like this and blow dry on cool. Cool. Y'all, that that freaking um stuff on my on my hairline makes me look like my forehead is so far back. <laughs> like it looks so far back. All right, y'all, so we're gonna go ahead and melt this lace into this forehead of mine, okay? So now what I'm about to do is go ahead and get a little plucky pluck going on. Before I cut the lace off, I'm just gonna pluck it. Make sure y'all pluck good so it looks real natural. Like we didn't bleach it, so it has to look natural. Yeah, so we gonna fix this part. Make sure that it's really flat because it is straight hair and you don't want it to be bumpy or lumpy or anything.
Alright, okay, y'all. So, we're going to go ahead and pluck our part and just make it straight. Okay, y'all, so we're going to take our concealer and angle brush. cut this lace off real quick so we just can continue the install y'all see that melt don't play <laughs> I know y'all see that. So y'all, I just moved my wig because I didn't like the positioning of it. So I'm gonna redo the um the got to be spray. So see how easy it comes up. Like if you if you want a stronger hold than that, of course you can glue it. I don't want to glue my wig today because I'm probably gonna. I might take it off. I don't know yet, but just in case I want to, I just don't feel like dealing with glue today. <laughs> so that's why I'm not going my wig today. Okay, y'all, the wig is on, like, for real. <laughs> I see it. I feel it. It's, it's in there. All right. So now what I'm about to do is go ahead and cut the baby hairs to how I like them. And I'm going to cut the baby hair. So I have this ready because I'm about to use foam and then I'm about to go ahead and do them real quick. And you got to have like your, um, your hair stuff because I got to do it real quick. <laughs> I got to be quick with it. So this moves right here and I'm going to hurry up and do my baby hairs. This is the Vigoro or something. And then I'm going to do my baby hairs real quick with this.
Okay. We're gonna blow dry this on hot. All right, y'all, so now we about to go ahead and just flat iron it because it's already straight, but y'all know we got to get it real straight. So I'm going to show you guys my flat iron technique, how to get it bone straight, and then we are done with this look. Okay, y'all, so I'm going to spray this weightless coconut oil. Y'all see how straight that got? Like, yes. And it's not stiff. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna take this off so that we can get it real good. And then that's the end of this hair. Tutorial. All right, baby. So we about to take this off. And yes, to the reveal. Don't ever play. This thing is metal. Oh, it's still a little wet. Okay, y'all, this is the final look. Yes, girl, yes, girl. Closure looking like a frontal. Do y'all see this? Yes. The only thing that I wish was different about this wig, I love it. I wish it was a little tad bit more thicker, but you could always add a bundle or you can always get it thicker um yeah that's the only thing other than that is real soft it's long like it's cute this is really cute like it's really giving 
um i hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel i love you guys and i can't wait to see you in the next video See,